question for today's session. In today's session, we are going to see how to add or remove elements from the DOM. Hello, Internet. Welcome to the Doing Ideas channel. JavaScript lesson 15 is going to be about adding and removing elements from the DOM. So we will learn how to create element, insert element, replace and remove elements from the DOM. This is a very common task in JavaScript. Okay, let's get into the code and see how we can create element from JavaScript. Okay, in main.js, I will create a variable called new element and I will use a document and create element function and pass in a tag or the element that I want to create. I want to create a li tag. Okay, so if we console log this, our new element, we will see that a new element has been created. Now I want to add text content to this element. So new element has a property called text content and I'm going to say I am a new element. And let's save and refresh and take a look at this object that we have created. As you can see now there's an inner HTML of I am a new element. Now let's append this element to our list. For this I have created order list and given it the ID of my list. So the parent node is the ordered list and the list tag is a child. So I want to append to this list uh, our new element. So we do that by using the append child. First we need to get the parent object. So I have used this ID and let's copy that and use our document.getElement by ID function to do this. So document.getElement by ID and pass in our ID. Now we have the parent node. Now let's do a list called the object list append child hello and and we'll use the append child function and pass in our new object new element okay let's save this and take a look so as you can see now this our, our new element has become the last element of this list so that is how we append or add a new item add a new element to our DOM, document object model okay now if we want to insert it before a particular element we can use the insert before function okay let's come in this and list object again the parent object and i'm going to use insert before and first parameter is going to be our new is going to be our new element so new element next what is the particular place that I want to insert this element before. So I want to get the first child of this parent element and insert it before that. Okay, so let's get the first element. So we know list has a property called first element child that we can use. Now this will refer to this first element of this list. So now I want to in insert this our new element before that. Let's refresh and we get our new element as the first element of this list. Okay, so that is the insert before. Now we can remove it. Easy enough, list, parent object, remove, child, and pass in our new element. This is the element that we want to remove and that will remove this. Our first element okay again the last function that we are going to talk about is the replace child so we can replace elements as well so replace I want to replace I'm going to create another element replace element replace element again use the create element function document dot create element I, I want another list tag and I want this replace and I want this replace element to have a text content of I am replacing you okay now again the replace that we are going to replace child function expects two parameters our new 
element that we want to replace so replace element is our new element that we want to replace our okay we are going to replace the new element object this object right here okay let's refresh let's comment this part out refresh and here is our new element now we want to replace this with our replace element okay so we do that by using the replace child function so this is the new uh, replace element and we are going to replace the new element okay and refresh and i am replacing you so the first element has been replaced by, by our second later element that we created okay so that is enough information uh, enough functions that you have to know uh, in order to add and remove replace elements in the dom using javascript uh, so and i again uh, ask you to go through the documentation of that mozilla provides i will add these links into the description so that you can read through them as well so thanks for watching do stay tuned for more javascript lessons do subscribe do share and do like and have a good day So welcome back students i hope you all have enjoyed the video and you have understood how to add remove and you can even uh, create new elements in dom so what do we mean by dom dom is nothing but document object model so uh, this video was really helpful for you all because you will have understood how to uh, add new children elements how to remove the children elements okay so this is very important concept uh, so we'll uh, continue in the next session thank you students